When the Chiefs play the 49ers in the Super Bowl, they're going to beat them. I've got the Chiefs beating the 49ers 37-30. to I predict that late in the fourth quarter, Patrick Mahomes is going to throw a 30-yard pass to Tariq Hill to seal the deal. And that's what I predict will happen. It's definitely going to be a great game. We know that both offenses are high-powered and can score tons of points. So they'll be trading points back and forth. I just believe that in the end, the Chiefs will find a way to pull it out. Patrick Mahomes will have a great game. I've got him throwing for over 300 yards. he probably have about four touchdowns. And I just think that the Chiefs offense will be able to score enough against that 49ers defense. The 49ers defense, they like to play a zone. The Chiefs run a West Coast offense with Andy Reid. And the West Coast offense is designed to pick apart zone defenses. So that's what I believe will happen. That 49ers zone defense, is gonna, they're going to be picked apart by Patrick Mahomes and those track star receivers. So Tyreek Hill and Hardeman and Sammy Watkins, they're going to attack that zone defense. They're going to all have big days along with Travis Kelsey. The 49ers secondary does not have an answer for all those talented receivers. Even Williams will get into the act. The running back for the Chiefs, he'll catch some passes as well and cause fits for that 49ers defense. Now, it's not going to be easy because we know that the 49ers defense has elite pass rushers. So they definitely know how to get to the quarterback they are going to cause a headache for Patrick Mahomes. There's no doubt about it. They're going to cause fits and problems for him. They're going to be in his face all day. But Patrick Mahomes is such an elite football player. He'll just find a way to get it done. Great players make great plays. They find a way to make things happen for their team. They find a way to be a lightning rod and to help their team win. And that's what Patrick Mahomes will do. He's talented enough to slow down the 49ers defense. Now, I am going to be honest here. I am concerned about the Chiefs defense because we know that the 49ers have a prolific rushing attack. They've got track stars as running backs while the Kansas City, while the Kansas City Chiefs have track stars at wide receivers. So the 49ers have a great rushing attack. They got Mostart, as we know, who had a great game against the Packers. I believe he had, what, over 200 yards rushing, and he had four touchdowns, if I'm not mistaken. So he had a great game against the Packers. And he'll probably call fits for the Kansas City run defense. The Kansas City defense is ranked 26th against the run, I believe. So he will probably cause damage against the Chiefs defense. Him and Breida might get into the act as well. I don't know if Tevin Coleman is playing. He had that shoulder injury against the Packers. But if he's there, he can also contribute as well. So I am concerned about the Chiefs' rush defense. But you know what? They might be able to slow them down. They did hold Henry of the Titans to only 69 yards rushing. So if they can hold Henry uh, to 69 yards rushing, then hey, anything is possible. Anything's possible. Hey, they might be able to hold most art to only 120 yards rushing. And if they do that, I'll take that. It'll definitely increase their chances of winning. We know the Chiefs is all about their offense anyway. And like I said, Patrick Mahomes and Sammy Watkins and Travis Kelsey and Nico Hardeman, they're, they're just going to cause fits for that 49 secondary. Richard Sherman is not going to be able to stop any of them. Tart. Witherspoon, whoever's playing for the 49ers secondary, they can't stop the Chiefs wide receivers. That zone defense that they play will be picked apart by the, 40, by the Kansas City Chiefs offense. So look for Patrick Mahomes to have a great game. He will help the Chiefs win the, their Super Bowl. And we know that Chiefs haven't been in the Super Bowl in about 50 years. So this would be great for them. They'll be celebrating on Sunday in Miami in Super Bowl 54. And I'm looking forward to seeing all of this go down.
thanks for watching thanks for listening please remember to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already just press that subscribe button below this video if you did that i'd greatly appreciate it and plus by subscribing you wouldn't miss out on the new content that i post so please remember to subscribe thanks again for watching thanks for listening i hope that you have a blessed wonderful day